Yo guys, you can see chaos on my table. I have been challenged by my two social media managers, Hokia, as you know already, and Catherine. So basically, they wanted me to do a GCSE paper, which has been randomly chosen by them. Uh, it's an AQA paper 2017. They want me to do this uh, without using a calculator. And Catherine basically told me about these hot chicken flavor ramens. So I've got two of these. I'm actually scared because I can taste the spice from just over there. So yeah, I've got to do this paper. I've got to munch this. I've got milk and water to help me out just in case I need it. But there are rules. So the rules I can see are uh, before I start, I need to eat three of these, three scoops of these. Every pickup of one of these drinks, if it's too hot, it's gonna minus two minutes from my time. Refills are allowed. I must finish two cups, so two of these. If I do another cup, I get an extra 30 minutes to complete this. If I use the calculator at any point, it'll minus 10 minutes. Extra time, if I want extra time, I have to do 10 push up for an extra five minutes. And then when I mark the paper, every wrong answer uh, is two bites of this. So, I'm a bit shook, I can't lie. I actually don't look at any of these papers. Um, when people do exams and people ask me about past papers, I don't ever look at them. So, yeah, it's uh, one of those. So, yeah, we will see, I guess. Is there anything else I need to... Uh... <laughs> that we have a POV of what I'm writing. Hey, yo, guys, I'm... I can't say it, but I'm really scared. How much, how, how hot is this compared to like a Nando's? I'm doing like the oh, Italian way, yeah. innit? I don't need a spoon. That's one. Oh, I'm so scared. How hot can these really be? I hope this isn't ASMR. <clears throat> is it one of those things where we'll kick in after? <clears throat> I'm worried if I have to go to the toilet after this, but I can feel on my lips. <laughs> 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 I <laughs> need two of these. I don't even want to have this last bite. <laughs> oh. Okay. Oh my god, that's so annoying. How am I supposed to do this without a calculator? <laughs> One wrong answer is what? Two bites. Would I rather lose 10 minutes? That's about 40. Bro, it's about 120 of. Bro, it doesn't even help. I'm using a calculator. I can't do 39 divided by 800. So that's 0 0.049. You can't even think properly when, you're, when your tongue is on fire. To go for a millimeter semi, I'm dividing by 100. So, uh, that one. And this one, you add them. 10 divided by 2, 5. It's going down by 8. So this would be that one. I can feel it in my legs. Odd, but not 7. Uh, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Yo, this is hard when my brain is all mashed up. A quarter, right? There's only four odd numbers left that you can choose from. The four digit code is changed to an even number. First digit is three. How many possible codes are there? So there's uh, five possible numbers for the last position. For the second last, there's 10 numbers you can have. Then the first digit is three, so you have one, so 500. All right. All right, when I get to question 10, I have a few more bites because I... Here I'm looking for the symmetry. So if I sub in two, let me draw the graph. I'm doing this in a pen, guys. You should be using a... Right on the corner, so the turning point. So it's going to be in between these two points, so 0 0.5. Now they are going to give a range. Um, I would say minus 2.25. Oh, God. This is criminal because I have to use a calculator. So that's the opposite. So I'm using sine 72. If I get a wrong answer, it's two bytes. I'm just doing that because they don't ask me to round it. Lily goes on a car journey for the first 30 minutes. Her average speed is 40 miles per hour. She then stops 50 minutes. So we want 15 mins. So we're dividing by four. 35 divided by one, right? 35 miles per hour. Here we'll show some information about some CDs. CD chosen at random, the probability is rock. Two divided by all of these added together, which would be three X. So 27 out of 40. Okay, obviously I would be checking all this on a calculator, but the pie chart so shows information about voters in an election. It's not looking good, men. Um, the total is two <clears throat> X. Oh, we're on question 10. Uh no. Do I just brave it? I want to see if I can do it without touching them. No, I'm not. Three, six, eight. All right. Write these numbers in descending order. Okay, when I get to 15, I'll finish that pot. Circle line that is the diameter of the circle. Ooh, 90. That's the right angle. So AD. Gina uses one bread roll and two cheese slices. Zero, ocho, five, two. So we add them together. Yeah. Okay. I think that's right. 
Graph shows the cost of some taxi journeys. Work out from your scene terms. I feel like it's so random with AQA in terms of the, the difficulty. Mate, I've got three fifths N plus 2.5. Hi, we're on 15. <laughs> I feel like when you watch these kind of videos, these food looks so peng. All right, next one at 20. Trying to work out the exact value of y using Pythagoras' theorem. Here's a working. 2y squared is 4y squared. Mel says y can't be 5 because the hypotenuse should be the longest side. Is Mel correct? Um, no, because it's 2y. Okay, here's a box plot. The fact that this question 16 is wild. I feel like some of the previous ones are harder than this. So you divide that by 5, so 20% more means it's 60. You would get 3x. It's 12. So it's 4 to 3. Oh, I feel dizzy. School has 86 teachers. 82 are male, 44 female. We're gonna probably that teacher's male. So one teacher who has blue eyes, what's probably to their male is 14. Rana sells 192 cakes in the ratio small, medium, large. Then have to do 88.75 divided by 56, which I can't do without a calculator. Easy, right, I'm using a calculator. 1.58. Ayo, it's whatever's on top of this. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, oh, I'm desperate for that milk. This is bad, because I'm gonna have to use the sign rule. <laughs> oh, yeah. X is the inverse sign. I'm going to use a calculator. 20.6. Give your answer two decimal places. No. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I'm using a calculator. I can't do 49 divided by 800. 10 square. Damn. 500. BCD is straight line. Okay. Minus 2B. Now I'm going to go along this. So minus 3A. Minus B, why is my voice so high now? Not multiples, nor of each other. Therefore not parallel. The histogram shows information. Five, so 10. 10 minutes is the answer. I need to do 10 push-ups. Oh, can you see? Oh wait, I'll do it here. Okay. <coughs> 10 push-ups. Yeah. <coughs> Four. Five. Six. <laughs> no, Otto, no way. D H E. Alright, add five. These are congruent triangles. Is 26 squared plus, and that's gonna work out BE, which then allows us to work out what the area of this sector is. I'm gonna say that's approximately 510 centimeters squared. A sketch of a quadrilateral ABC is shown. This is reflected in Y equals X. The one that's invariant is 1, 1 because that's on that line. Okay, so H of X is the cube root. On the grid, draw the graph of the inverse. And now we here. That is a beautiful graph, mate. Four values of sine, f of x is sine x, g of x is x plus 90, which is the sine graph shifted to the left by 90 degrees. Now the sine graph looks like this. So this is where 90 is. So we'll start at one. So the graph will look something beautiful. That finish. <laughs> yeah, boy, let's go. Right, guys, we are back. It's time for me to mark this. Now, I'm actually gonna put more on the line here. So if I get 100%, Hokio needs to munch a whole one of these. He's gonna sit here and he's gonna munch all of this to see how painful it is. But let's see if I actually get 100%. Otherwise, if I get a wrong question, two bites. I'm allowed to have my coffee now, but let's go. Question one, I had to use a, a calculator. It was not looking good, but we got 0 0.49, 0 0.36. Oh, 5, 7, 98, ooh, 5, 8, 1 quarter, 500. <clears throat> Hockey is sweating. 4, 0, 0. Uh, then the diagram obviously comes from that. Part B, where's the answer? 2.5 and minus 2.1. I mean, that's the exact value, so. Here they didn't tell me to put an, like, uh, to actually put an answer. The answer is 8 sine 72, but it doesn't say to decimalize it. It doesn't mean it's wrong. Use trigonometry to work out the length of x. 8 sine 72, that's what it says. And then it says answers between 7.6 and 7.61. I'm, I'm, I'm ticking that. Here's AQA bugging. All right, 0, 0, 30, 20, then a straight line, then up to 35, cool. The speed, 35. <laughs> Hockey is biting his nails. <laughs> uh, 27 over 40. Oh, this one was annoying without a calculator. 8640. <laughs> Tens, yeah, cool. AD, let's go. <clears throat> question 13. 40.84, did I not use a Oh, I didn't even need a calculator. For hey, yo, this question was annoying. I thought I was gonna get this wrong. N plus 2.5, yeah. Identify is correct. Error, error, error. Part B, no invalid reason, no, and the hypotenuse is 10. We got 28. <laughs> Where was the odd, like, really annoying question? I can't remember. There was one, something like Rita and the Prophet. I actually think I might get that one wrong, I can't lie. 
I didn't even check my working. Four to three. 28, 14, 11, 33. 14 out of 25. Oh, no, it's Rita. Cocky eyes. Oh, depend on this, because I know I'm going to get the rest of the paper correct. No. It's 1.28. I wrote 1.58. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> no! No! Oh, my God. Oh, where did I go wrong? Why are you guys so happy? Yeah. I don't see why that's wrong. 88.7. Wait. Five. <laughs> I lost three marks. Uh, 20.6. It's not looking good. It's not looking good. Uh, tiny bite. Oh, what have I done wrong here? Again. Again. Let's go. Oh. oh. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, yeah. oh, no. You have to take away 45. Oh, crap. I just, I didn't, I did 500. Oh, I'm dying. I've lost four marks. <laughs> oh, no. Wait. <laughs> Wait. What? Lower quartile 10. It wants the inter quartile range. Crap. Oh, I didn't read the question. Yeah. Okay. The working is fine. Okay. I feel weird. What did I mess up? I messed up. Rita. I actually feel weird. So I lost three marks, one mark, so four marks, six marks. Oh. So I got 74 out of 80. What is that? 93%. Okay, I need to drink milk. Hey, yo, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed today's video. Uh, I don't think I'm doing this again. But if you enjoyed today's video, I'd appreciate if you liked the video and subscribe for more content like this. I'll see you guys in the next one. Nice. <laughs> oh.